hello dear challengers and hard workers for excelse exam 2026 welcome back to my channel two questions four marks less concepts simple questions to score four marks the unit will be heredity dear students i have explained line by line with clear understanding of the concepts and also i have included previous year questions so do watch the complete video to score four marks do subscribe the channel and also do join the whatsapp channel the link is in the description so that you will not miss out any important video or notification regarding examination take your textbook pen and notebook watch the complete video make a list mind map so that you will be able to answer all the questions in your examination so next unit heredity and evolution see heredity and evolution you should know about the importance of variation you should know the importance of variation so the important question is how does variation helps in survival of an species so during reproduction dna copying is an important event event right so during those the variation occurs because of the variation it it will be able to adapt to the surrounding condition because of that the chances are more that the species will survive See what is heredity? The transfer of parental characters to the offspring is called as what? Heredity. You have an experiment, uh, Mendel's experiment here, to show that the traits can be dominant or recessive. So the very important concept. Definite three or four mark question for the exam. See from the examination point of view, the important three or four mark question. What you can ex uh, expect is. Mendel's monohybrid and dihybrid experiment both explain the concept of the trait can be dominant or recessive. With the help of the checkerboard, you should explain monohybrid or dihybrid cross. If you explain that, you can score easily three or four marks. The traits in the examination, the traits can be changed, but the concept remains same. The ratio, the monohybrid ratio is one is to three is to one, whereas the dihybrid ratio is nine is to three is to three is to one. How do the trait gets expressed? How the daughter cells receives the same copy as the parental chromosomes right instead of uh, doubling the number of chromosomes the daughter cells receive the same number of chromosomes as present in the parents this is a very important concept already i have uh, explained in how do organisms reproduce now the next important concept is sex determination so the male contains sex chromosomes xy female contains xx if x of the male fuses with x of the female then it is female baby then if y of the male fuses with x of the female then it is a male baby so sex determination in human beings is an important three mark question with figure you can explain this unit heredity and heredity and evolution very important chapter definitely four mark question will be asked from this chapter a pure dominant pea plant producing round yellow seeds is crossed with pure recessive pea plant producing wrinkled green seeds the number of plants bearing round green seeds in f1 generation will be zero because the dominant in f1 generation the dominant will be produced
what are fossils the preserved traces of living organism are called as fossils what are the difference between analogous and homologous organs difference between sex chromosomes of man and sex chromosomes of woman sex of the child is determined by father how difference between homologous organs of different organism having common origin homologous common origin analogous different origin they have similar structure perform different function they have different structure they, they perform what similar function four limbs of frog and four limbs of bird wings of bird and wings of bat are analogous women has perfect pair of sex chromosome that is both x that is x x man has normal size chromosome x and another short size chromosome y a child who, who inherits x chromosome from her father will be girl and a child who inherits y chromosome from his father will be boy both girl and the boy inherit only x chromosome from the mother therefore the sex of the child is determined the determined by the father observe the following table which shows the contrasting forms of pea plants color of the seed g and green is capital g yellow is small g position of the flower axial capital a terminal a. therefore it is the genetic makeup with green seed it will be capital g small g with terminal flowers it is small a small a. therefore the correct answer is option d name the factor responsible for speciation the factors that is responsible for speciation is natural selection genetic geographical isolation and also the variations are the reasons for the responsible for speciation how does relative method help to determine the age of fossils gives the information that fossils which are closer to the surface are more recent than those in the deeper layers next question experiences of experiences of an individual during his lifetime cannot be direct evolution change change in the non reproductive tissues cannot be passed on to the dna of germ cells Ex experiences gained by, gained by the organism is not transferred to the dna hence cannot be transferred to the next generation chromosomes inherited from father determine the sex of the child because if the baby inherits x chromosome from the father it will be a girl if it is y it is a boy hence father decides the sex of the child the gene for brown colored hair is recessive that of a gene for black colored hair what is the hair color of a person who has inherited gene from brown colored hair from mother and black colored hair from the father so it will be black colored hair because it is dominant the plant bearing yellow colored seed are self pollinated with same plant represents the result in f2 generation of diabetic cause with the help of chakabur mention the varieties of plants have produced in f2 generation this is uh, diabetic cause experiment the cause between two individuals which differs in two traits so do uh, learn the mono hybrid cause experiment and also diabetic cause experiment i'll explain these two experiments in detail in separate video do practice well definite question for your examination what is evolution name the three evidences for evolution what is evolution phenomenon of gradual change of organism from simple form to into complex form in a long period is called as evolution three evidences for uh, evolution are homologous analogous organs and also fossils this i have explained in difference between you can write explain the two methods to estimate the age of fossils one is relative method if we dig into the the fossils which we find closer to the earth surface are more recent than the fossils we find in the deeper layers by detecting the ratio of different isotopes of the same element in the fossil again it is more dry hybrid the cross section do learn if round green seeded 
pea plant is caused to inculcate its pea plant the seeds produced in f1 generally round and it will be yellow seed because they are dominant homologous organs have same structure but perform different function the experiences of an individual during his lifetime cannot be passed on his progeny because they are acquired traits tall pea plants having round seeds are caused with dwarf pea plants with having wrinkled seed the progeny obtained in it will be tall with round because they are dominant you can see the capital letter indicates a dominance analogous organs have different structure but they perform the same function in f the age uh, genotypic ratio of f2 generation of mendel's monohybrid cross experiment is 1 is to 2 is to 1 Phenotypic ratio is three to one. And tall pea plant is caused with dwarf pea plant represent the result in F three generation with the help of Chakrabu mentioned the ratios of varieties plant. See, it's very simple experiment mono hybrid cross experiment for the three marks do practice well. The experiences of an individual acquired during its lifetime cannot be passed on its progeny. Give reason. Change in non-reproductive tissues cannot be passed on to the DNA of germ cells. Mention the four factors that lead to the rise of new species: geographical isolation, natural selection, inheritance of traits, genetic drift, or gene flow variation or mutation or changes in the DNA. These are the reasons for the speciation or the evolution of new species. What are fossils? Mention the methods of estimation of dating fossils and explain briefly. Already we have learned this question. Name the sexes of child born by receiving X chromosome from father. It will be female child or baby girl. Can the wings of butterfly and wings of bat be con considered as analogous? If yes, why? If no, why? Yes, these structures are considered as analogous because the wings of bat and wings of b uh, bat both are useful for flight. That is same function, but they design. and origin are not same and individual cannot pass the experience acquired during its lifetime to the progeny because it does not change anything in the non reproductive tissues the change sorry, change in the non reproductive tissues cannot be passed on to the dna of the germ cells hence this cannot at uh, pass to the next generation for example if you breed a group of mice all the progeny will have straight tails as it now if i if the tails of this mice are removed by surgery in each generation the tailless mice produce tailed progeny because the removal of tail cannot change the genes of the germ cells again monohybrid cross experiment mention the two used for tracing evolution relationship between the organism excavating time dating study fossil Determining DNA sequences. These are the evolutionary tools, uh, uh, tracing uh, tools which we trace for evolutionary relationship. Diabetic cross experiment for four marks. Do practice well. Analyze the situation given below. Situation: the number of green grasshoppers in a green zone has been increasing from one generation because natural selection is possible among the organism of new generation. Green grasshoppers, new combination genetic may have been accumulating, and genetic drift increases. In what is situation two? The number of brown grasshoppers in the same green zone have been reducing because because natural selection is not possible due to this. The number of brown grasshoppers is reduced may disappear in future. So the natural selection is an important event. Next question. Student A tells student B that wing of bird and arm of uh, human are analogous. Student B replies both of them are analogous. Whose answer is correct? Student Student B's answer is correct because they might have evolved from the common ancestor. They the basic structure of wing and arm is similar. They perform different function. They are analogous. Diabrid. 
again mono hybrid cross experiment and traits cannot be passed which the experiences of an individual acquired during his lifetime cannot be passed his progeny dear students these are the other important question for examination you can see that mono hybrid experiment hybrid cross experiment is very important how the sex of the child is determined um, and uh, fossils how to determine the age of fossils all these are quite important question do try to learn and practice all these questions the next two chapters our environment as well as sustainable management of uh, natural resources i leave it to you to study for the examination during the next